Hello dear friends. Today we're out on the ocean again uh, or at, a, in, a, in a little uh, cove in a yeah you see the rock faces behind us uh, and probably you hear all the birds turn stones and gill moths and everybody and maybe you hear a splash of the seals that are around us and I'm here today to tell you a story about how to deal with rocks yeah and it was last year and we were anchored I, I squeezed in a little rocky uh, a cove in order to anchor and to be protected for the night and in the morning no matter what I tried I could not get the anchor up again I tried for half an hour with all the tricks of my how many 40 years of uh, sailing and everything that I ever got an anchor loose and after about half an hour I really had exhausted all the strength of my back and all the the, 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 uh, the brains I had and I was totally exhausted and told my wife Barb I think I have to cut the anchor yeah we have to go back I don't know how to get this up and so I was sitting there and uh, disappointed and already seeing our holidays uh, being cut short and and then I told Bob give me my tobacco I have an idea so she gave me my tobacco I gave uh, I took a pinch of tobacco and uh, started talking with the rock and said you know rock you really hold this anchor safely you kept it safe all night yeah and I can see really how much you like us because you don't want to let us go yeah and I'm really honored for that and I thank you but we really want to go and I also would like to have the uh, to have the anchor with me and so if you would be so kind to give me the anchor that would be great and I give you this tobacco as a token of my gratitude of my appreciation and I promise you I will tell the story and I put the tobacco in the water and got in my boat uh, got uh, turned the motor on lifted the anchor and the anchor came loose so this is just one of those stories that I really love we talk so often about nature and we forget that nature is listening to us and nature is talking with us maybe we should talk more with nature and to nature and to earth and instead of making everything an it and an object that we can do with whatever we want so and if you ever think you can't talk with a rock think of this story thank you for listening today and have a wonderful day bye